Imagine an atom that has lots of electrons. The electrons in an atom are only allowed to occupy distinct energy levels. They can't take on any arbitrary energy value. Quantum mechanics requires that the energy levels are quantized. However, we also know that electrons in the same system within an atom cannot be in the same quantum state as another electron because of the Pauli exclusion principle. Specifically, two identical electrons can't occupy the same energy level. Instead, two electrons are able to occupy one energy level if one electron has an upspin while the other electron has a downspin, thereby keeping their quantum states separate and distinct. The energy levels of an atom are filled up from the lowest energy levels upward to the higher energy levels. Each subsequent energy level requires more energy for pairs of electrons to be able to occupy it. In chemistry, it's the outer electrons, the ones at the upper energy levels, that play a role in chemical reactions, either to accept, donate, or share electrons between reacting atoms. The Pauli exclusion principle is the reason that electrons have to occupy these distinct sets of energy levels. Atoms of different elements have different numbers of electrons occupying different energy levels, which provides a unique chemistry for how atoms interact with each other. If electrons followed the rules of bosons, there would be no issue with two or more electrons occupying the same energy levels, and in fact, they would be preferred. This would result in atoms having electrons in their lowest energy levels with all atoms possessing a similar kind of chemistry, providing far less variety of atomic interactions and less diversity in matter.